hacking by Happy Technologies Chennai, iBoards by Harjan Pune, mobile operating system by Ethics Technologies Tamil, and helicopter with the Department of Aeronautics Engineering VIT, Sadia Mangal. And next is the guest lecture through video conference. We have an excellent video conference facilities in our college. Through that, we can have uh, three lectures through video conference. Development Engineering Education by Ms. Jennifer Dover, President, Students Platform for Engineering Education Development, that's called SPEED from ESA. And critical thinking for professional success by Dr. M.P. Puspalada, Head, Department of Languages, Nuclear Mumbai, Publications, Media Relations, Bits Planning. And each department will organize its own technical events, still it's going on. And another important thing is we will get some problem from the industries and our students along with our department people will solve the problem industry and we will take as a consultancy work also. As part of Future of 2011, 59 industry defined problems have been collected from the following industries and these problems are distributed among all the departments depending on the nature of the problem or suitable solution. The solutions will be presented to the industries. The companies are Roots Group of Companies, Pantuchur, Mahedra Water Distilleries, Center Eero, and GD Power Systems, Madurai, Naval Ignite Corporation, Naval, Tamil Nadu Newsprint and Paper Limited, Karur, Banari Sugas Limited, Satya Mangalam, Nexus Global Solution, Pantuchur, Payoda Technologies Private Limited, Pantuchur, Roots Cash Private Limited, Pantuchur, Fungaja Mills, and then Burhan Mills, Pantuchur, Banari Sugas Distilleries Division, Bavani, Sun Glow, Payotech, Pantuchur, Sunlink, Payotech, Booty, and then Net Fusion Technologies, Coimbatore, Chair and Industries, Coimbatore, Arkham Industries, Zipcar, Radipet, Springtime Enterprises, Coimbatore. The another important thing what Dr. has told is the Dr. SV Foundation Awards for the Principals. In recognition of the Venturi service of the teaching community, Dr. SV Foundation Awards for the best high secondary school Principals has also been instituted. This year, 10 best Principals have been identified through various parameters and each of them will be honored with a cash about up to be 10,000 and a citation. And an event for schools, that also Andrea has indicated, an exclusive event for schools is also conducted during future to create a scientific temper and innovative zeal among the young minds. This one day event has been organized today. Various combo competitions like quiz programs, poem composition English and Tamil, oratorical competition English and Tamil, essay writing English and Tamil, program contest, painting competition, pencil drawing, yoga contest, Ken's Proto, that is solving equations and project equation have been conducted for school children from right from the morning. Around 1000 students have participated and 3000 students have visited the campus from about 150 schools in Eero, Tripur, Karur, Namakal, Dharmaburi, Krishnagiri, Salem, Kaimachur and Nilagiri districts in the one day event. Prize will be distributed to the students to the tune of rupees 50,000 along with the participants and in participation and various certificates. And open house exhibition, a three day open house project exhibition is also conducted during 8 to 10 September 2011 at the institute permissions to create a sense of awareness among school children and college students on the latest scientific and technological innovations. The students of BAT have displayed around 500 projects in all the laboratories of all the departments. BAT has sent invitation to about 200-2000 colleges in India and 360 schools in the neighboring districts of Eero and we anticipate about 4000 students from the college and 6000 students from schools to visit the project exhibition for the coming the remaining two days. Elaborate transport arrangements have been made to bring all the industrial school children for this technical festival. The school children and the teachers accompanying them are provided with the refreshment and lunch in the college campus. Besides, this is school children are provided career counseling by the heads of the departments and senior professor of BIT and then seminar halls. And finally, we have a valedictory function the third day. The valedictory function of Future of 2011 will be held on 10th September 2011. Dr. K.P. Isaac, Member Secretary, All India Council for Technical Education, New Delhi, will be the chief guest and deliver the valedictory address and distribute prizes to the winners of Technical Symposium and Project Design Contest. I assure that Future of 2011 will emerge more successful than the predecessors and be highly memorable and rewarding period in the annals of the Institute. May Future of 2011 be way for more innovations and create avenues for the upgrades of job budding technocrats. I wish Future of 2011 a grand success. Thank you. Esteemed Chief Guest of the Day, 
डॉक्टर दिनेश कुमार परिवार मेंबर सेक्रेटरी एम बी ए डॉक्टर राम डॉक्टर नागराजन डॉक्टर सनो डॉक्टर तंगरा स्टूडेंट रिप्रेजेंटेटिव शर्मा प्राउड प्रिंसिपल्स एंड हेड मिस्ट्रेस ऑफ वेरियस स्कूल्स वर गोइंग टू बी ऑन इट हियर टुडे आवर लेंडेड फैकल्टी मेंबर्स स्टूडेंट्स फ्रॉम different parts of the country for many engineering colleges and also schools and our dear students friends mr gudan our governing council member proud parents and friends from the media i am extremely happy to again tell you that dr kalwa member secretary though he had not kept up well in health for the last 3 4 days he made it a point in fact we doubted whether he is be will able to make a trip today to this part from delhi because he was laid up in the hospital in spite of that it shows his love and affection for the student community that he should be present here and address you all we have four programs as it is though we call it as future of 2011 one it is the symposium where number of students from many colleges about which our uh, dr sundar ram nes less Dr. Sanmo has very clearly brought out in their delivery the need for the future of and the benefits. The students, not only from our college, students from other colleges also exchange between themselves by presenting papers, which are evaluated by experts. from the industry and also from academia as well as the project contest which will also be judged by a team of industry connected entrepreneurs who will make a visit i think a day after tomorrow and finally they will select the best project which according to their views will be number 1 number 2 number 3 in the rank and they are going to be rewarded with the cash prize of 50000 20000 and 10000 like which the papers presented also have been selected and the students will be presenting in the presence of various academicians and also people from the industry and they will also be selected they will also be paid the prize money our principal has very clearly stated that this type of feature of technical symposium as well as the projects that are being presented by you will give certainly an insight of what in future the demand is going to be in fact with this idea only we are not stop with only the technicality of the subject we want the students to study the technology that they are able to analyze and adopt it in the various fields for which only this teacher or symposium will give a insight will make you to think how to go that's why even the students from various schools about 5000 students from various schools are going to visit the various projects that you are taking exhibiting here so that they will have an also idea in the early ages what they should do when they join the engineering college this is with this view only we are conducting this uh, uh, feature of and in uh, in our institute we don't stop with only the academic part of it we are trying to 
interact with the industries. In fact, to name a company by name, Sestra from uh, Germany, they have said, yes, they have, they have in fact to given us a lot of equipments. So what is the pneumatic uh, portion of it? And they are going to teach not only our faculty and also visit our college and interact with the students and show them what are the future aspirations from the industry so that you know you are now itself put onto the line what you should think and what you have to do for the future. Like is CN Technologies is one of the IT solution company which teaches you not only really limited only software and hardware, the application what it is going to be in future. The, the feature, uh, you know, cloud computing. All the service will be no more. Will be in the colleges or in the factories or in the offices. Everything will be only from the cloud, wherein you can draw. You can just take your computer or you need not even go with computer. You need not have to carry any of your sticks. You just go anywhere, get to the computer and you can uh, draw whatever with your password, you will be able to draw whatever information you need and be able to work on that. That is going to be the feature for which, you know, CA technologies are training our students and like this we are trying to going to have feature uh, many more companies to come in so that even during the time when the students are studying in our college, they will have the feel of the industry and they will be selected once they come out of the college after passing this examination. That's how the feature is going to be with this idea only, this technical symposium and project contest has been now been uh, continuously for the last 13 years carried out in our uh, college. I'm happy also to note that number of you know, students from other colleges not only from Tamil Nadu, people from students from uh, Kerala, Madhya from, uh, from UP, Karnataka, Andhra, they all uh, have participated. I am sure they will have a, a good hospitality by the students of our college and also you will spend these three days which will enrich your knowledge and uh, this event is going uh, is making all the attempts to make the students in extending their expertise with respect to science and technology so that the India becomes a superpower. At this juncture, I am extremely happy to convey my greetings to every one of you present here and uh, we have with us the principals and uh, headmistress of 10 schools who have been selected as the best teachers. You know, every year, the month of September, we celebrate September 5th as the Teachers Day. Muliyala uh, Dari, Madha Pridha Guru Deva. After our parents, it is only the teacher who has been able to make us either come up with life or more our life that is possible. So, we select, we always, this day, this month of September, we like to pray our um, pronouns to the faculty members everywhere in the country, everywhere in the world and today we would like to recognize 10 of the school uh, principals and uh, the headmistress which are named they have and uh, we wish to honor them and I wish to congratulate them after my greetings to them and thank you very much Jai Hind.
Good afternoon to all of you and it's my pleasure to be here with you at this occasion of Future Act 2011. I would like to say a few words about Future Act. What is my interpretation of Future Act? Why this? <coughs> Uh, such an event as Futura. When I say organizer, definitely the inspiration, support comes from the chairman of the group. Along with those who conceptualized this event way back, I think 12 years back from now, uh, my interpretation is that by the colleges, including BIT, across the nation. The young students who are yet to enter into the stream of higher education are the future of the nation. The science and technology is a very important stream in which our country has to work. If I may recall a program of Government of India which was launched, I think, some 20 years back on Doordarshan channel. At that time, there was no private channels, so there was a large number. Government of India started a program in the name of, uh, for the purpose of development of scientific temper among students. And the program was designed and presented himself by a personality none other than Professor Yashpal, who held the position of Chairman University Science Commission. So at that time, it was felt that we should inculcate the desire, the trust among the students for science and technology. And how important that was, which I can explain to you in the following words, and how that made the uh, impact. Only after that, India was recognized as a power in software industry. Our software engineers worldwide recognized as the genius software engineers. If we go back and try to think why it has happened, from when it has started, you know, it's very simple that it cannot happen overnight. The government the visionaries as well as the private institutions, they work very hard and they imparted scientific temper into the students. And I am sure this program will take this lead further again. Still there is a requirement to produce a large number of engineers in the country, a large number of technologists in the country. And for that, you have to prepare the young students. You have to shape the mind of the young students in the line that they should think about science. They should think that they have to make technology, engineering, science, medicine as their career. When the student remains in senior secondary grade, that is the T age very tender age. That age requires grooming of the student. And I am very sure the programs like Futura are very important to expose them, to ignite their minds towards the science, towards the technology. Now on a very light note, <coughs> another vision of the chairman is, you know, I can see just now over here, they have released this souvenir in uh, CD form. Generally, the traditional practice is to have it in a printed form. Nowadays, we are talking about environment, we are talking about carbon credit. So once you are going to use more and more paper, what you are going to do? The entire world is thinking that how to cut down the carbon credits. How to cut down the emission of carbon dioxide, carbon monoxide, or we call it greenhouse gases. So this is another attempt to 
to reduce the dependence on paper or to reduce the use of paper and move towards e-form of the learning material or the publicity.